function f is defined by this is function f given that f2 is equal to 3 and f3 is equal to 2 find the value of k okay and okay, this one lah so we see here f x is equal to m over x minus 1 plus m so we see here we have two variable and we see f2 is equal to 3 this is fx we know that when we change x to 2 everything with x will change to 2 so this one is x this one is x so here we have m over 2 minus 1 plus n and we know that f2 is equal to 3 so here we get 2 minus 1 is 1 so m plus n is equal to 3 this is the first one and here we see f3 is equal to 2 fx is this one so f3 is equal to so m divided by 3 minus 1 plus n is equal to 2 so we see here m plus 2 3 minus 1 is 2 plus n is equal to 2 so we want to remove the uh, the denominator we multiply everything with 2 so here we get m plus 2n is equal to 4. This is the second equation. So you see here, you can do the elimination because you have m plus n is equal to 3. So here I just put here m plus 2n is equal to 4. This is the second one. You see here, you can do the elimination of m. When you minus the two equation, you will get 0. You see here m minus m is 0. So 2n minus n is n is equal to 4 minus 3 is 1 now you get n is equal to 1 so you get n is equal to 1 so you have uh, 1 or 2 so you know n is equal to 1 if you take from 1 m plus 1 is equal to 3 so m is equal to 3 minus 1 so you get 2 so i forgot to do a but never mind but for b m is equal to 2 n is equal to 1 So you see here the value of k, x is not equal to k, what does it mean? We have denominator x minus 1, so we, we make it x minus 1 is equal to 0, so x is equal to 1. So k is equal to 1. Why we make it equal to 0? Because we know that we cannot divide anything with 0. Anything divided by 0 is something that cannot be found. You can try using your... So C F to X. So you can find Fx because you already have the value of M and N. So we see here alamat alamat Fx is equal to so M is equal to 2 divided by X is X lah. X minus 1 plus N. N is equal to 1 plus 1. So F to X is also equal to F fx so we start with f first fx is equal to here is 2 over x minus 1 plus 1 so f fx you see here we are changing x to fx so here we get 2 over fx minus 1 plus 1 so f2x is equal to so here is 2 over fx is equal to 2 over x minus 1 plus 1 and then here minus 1 plus 1 which is equal to so 1 minus 1 is 0 and 2 over 2 divided by 2 over x minus 1 is equal to 2 times x minus 1 divided by 2 plus 1 so here 2 can be cut off so x minus 1 plus 1 so you get x so f to x is equal to x So df inverse 2. So you need to find what is f inverse x first before you can substitute the value of x. So inverse function, what you need to do is first equal to y, then you find x. 
Dan x is the inverse function. So, f x is equal to, here is 2 over x minus 1 plus 1. This is f x. So, you make it equal to y. You get 2 over x minus 1 plus 1 is equal to y. Now, you find x. So, 2 over x minus 1 is equal to, so you bring to the right, you get x minus, y minus 1. Now, you wanted to find x. So, you change place here. So, you get x minus 1 is equal to 2 over y minus 1. So, here you get x is equal to 2 over y minus 1 plus 1. So, you see you bring 1 to the right. So, now we have x is the inverse function but in term of y. You see here the variable is y. So, the inverse function of fx is f inverse y in term of y right 2 over y minus 1 plus 1 so in term of x f inverse x is equal to 2 over x minus 1 plus 1 or instead of changing to x because the equation already mentioned 2 you can just directly change this one to 2 so here f inverse x is equal to 2 is equal to 2 divided by 2 minus 1 plus 1. So here you get 2 over 2 minus 1 is 1 plus 1. 2 plus 1 is equal to 3. So f inverse 2 is equal to 3.